Hi, I'm Peggy with Hilltop Camper and RV. Today we're going to talk about a few of the main power switches located inside the door in the motorhomes. Inside the door you're going to find a main power switch. When the light is red, that means that the power is on. When you hit this button and the red light goes off, that will cut off all the power to the chassis, excuse me, all the power to the livable space in the motorhome. On some models this will even cut off the refrigerator power, so make sure you know if you need to leave this on. Next to that you have the power step and the awning light. When you open the door, the step will automatically go out. Once you're camping, if you want to turn this off, that will keep that step from retracting, making sure that you don't have people rushing out the door with no step there. So you can turn this off, again, once you're parked and camping. As a safety override, once you turn the ignition key, that step will go back in, even if your switch is in the off position. When you travel, it is always best to leave it in the on position so that door, or once the door opens and closes, the step will go in and out. The awning light, once your awning is open, you can flip this on and you'll usually have an LED light, usually either against the motorhome itself or against the roller tube. Once you're parked and ready to use your awning, you'll find the switch at this location as well. You'll want to hit the out button, the awning will start to come out. Once you see the roller tube, you're going to want to stop. Otherwise, the roller will keep going in the inverted position and will not be as tight against the motorhome during travel. When you're ready to roll the awning back in, you just simply push the in button. Please remember to never extend your awning when you're not sitting underneath it. If you're going to run an errand or you're going to go to bed at night, you always want that awning to be in because the winds will catch it and do a lot of damage. If your motorhome is equipped with outside speakers, you will have a switch here to run those outside speakers or have them inside. Once you start to travel, you turn your music on and you're not hearing music inside, always remember to check this switch. Thank you for watching today. I hope these tips have been helpful. Please remember to click on the subscribe button for more helpful hints and videos.